Raymond Gilmore infiltrated the IRA at the height of the troubles in Northern Ireland. A supergrass witness, he later earned himself an IRA death sentence. I brought the provisional IRA to their knees in Derry, and I have saved countless amount of lives. But living under a false identity for almost 30 years, he says he's been failed by the intelligence services. The contractual agreements between an agent, that's who we're talking about, who worked for the government in the dirtiest war ever, this side of Kosovo, that that agent should be protected and should be given his contractual obligations. For some, though, Raymond Gilmore is still remembered as a traitor, guilty of betrayal. With the assistance of his MP, he is now taking his case to the Investigatory Powers Tribunal, a body which examines complaints against the intelligence services. Is this just about money? Not at all. It's about the, the betrayal of uh, the intelligence services, security services towards me. The Home Office say they do not comment on intelligence matters. Raymond Gilmore accepts speaking out could endanger his life, but he says he's been left with little choice. Colin Campbell, BBC News.